strong. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Hasty. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behavior. Please be seated. Remember, warriors, to follow the three W's. Wear your mask, wash your hands with soap, and wash your physical distance. May 3rd to May 6th, 6th and 7th graders will be testing. Please be courteous when moving about the building during that time. Hey ladies, if you're thinking about being a booth cheerleader, then listen up. On Thursday, April 29th, 2021, from 5.30 to 6.30 p.m., there will be an informational meeting for all potential cheerleaders and parents in the Booth Media Center. The last day to submit all forms and paperwork to Coach Lowry in room 709 is Friday, May 7th, 2021. May 11th to May 13th, 2021, from 3.10 to 6 p.m., there will be tryouts for football cheerleading team will be in the Booth Annex. May 14th, from 3.10 to 5 o'clock, Uniform and practice clothes sizing will take place in the booth annex. Check the front office for forms and documentation starting Monday, April 26. Any additional questions regarding tryouts can be sent to lowry.brandy at mail.fcboe.org. There will be a meeting for all 6th and 7th grade girls wanting to try out for the BMS volleyball next year. The meeting is May 6th in the gym at 7.55 a.m. If you arrive late, please still come to the gym to get the information. Don't forget, a warrior is always responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Mary with a few words of wisdom. Do you consider yourself to be a person of strong character? If you believe you have a strong character, how do you achieve it? Some of you have been fortunate enough to have had good role models guide you along the way. Others have had to develop character by overcoming great obstacles. Now listen to this American proverb. Strong character depends not so much upon chances as upon choices. So regardless of how you have developed your character, one thing is for sure. You've learned to make some smart choices along the way. If you're a person of character, try to look for leadership roles so then you can empower others to make smart choices too. With something to think about, this is Mary, and make it a great day or not. The choice is always yours. Hey book lovers, guess what? There's going to be a book fair for in-house and virtual. Shopping dates are going to be May 10th through May 14th. Online shopping dates are going to be May 3rd through May 16th. The hours for shopping will be 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., but on May 14th, the hours will be from 8 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. Thanks, Ms. Mosley, for putting the book fair together for us. Mother doesn't want a dog. Mother says they smell. And never sit when you say sit or even when you yell. And when you come home late at night and there is ice and snow, you have to go back out because the dumb dog has to go. Mother doesn't want a dog. Mother says they shed. And they always let the strangers in and bark at friends instead. And do disgraceful things on rugs and track mud on the floor. And flop up on your bed late at night and swear their doggy snore. Mother doesn't want a dog, she's making a mistake, because more than a dog, I think she will not want the snake. Sorry, I gotta go. I'm late.
Oof! You late! Hey man, watch where you're going! Come on! Hey, you have to check in! look like you? If so, you may be suffering from chronic lateness. But don't fear, because we at Warrior News are committed to helping you. There are a few easy steps you can take to prevent tardiness. Set your alarm, have a routine, use your agenda, and get homework done. 